Some of you came far, Florida, Georgia, North Carolina, upstate, Maryland, wherever. We really, really, really thank you all for coming. Um, 30 years. My <laughs> On behalf of myself, Patricia, and Warren, we... Um, when we started out, we put it out there, and we was trying to get the, the uh, committee together, and we didn't get too many bites. So I was like, well, I'm an event planner. I'll do it for free. No problem. I'll take it on. They were like, oh, okay, we'll just let you run with it. But what I did was I was just trying to make it where we can all get together, have some good food, um, some dancing, and most of you talked the whole night. I didn't see a couple of you dancing. Suzanne and Michelle. Laura. They were Which Suzanne? Roberts. <laughs> Dr. Roberts. <laughs> we want to thank Suzanne. She's an angel. But truly, you know, we've all come a long way. And um, right now, we just want to take a moment of silence. We lost our principal, Mr. Blaustein. Um, we've lost some others along the way. So we just want to take a moment of silence and bow our heads in respect to those that are no longer with us. Okay. And... Um, does anybody else have anything they want to say or, you know, you know, watch. Life, life is good. <laughs> you know, we have a few great, any grandparents in the house? Oh we got grandparents here. We got grandparents here. We got some retirees in the house. <laughs> life is good. Um, but I do ask on a serious note, what's our Facebook page? <laughs> okay, so everybody who could post whatever you took tonight to the Facebook page. That's super important because a lot of us didn't get a chance to take pictures. I got more running around and everything, but I want to be able to live the night through the photos as well. So please post those photos. Um, we had the Franklin reporter here earlier. He took some pictures. There's going to be an article coming out this week. Please uh, check that out as well. Um, whoever has your books, we thank you for bringing them because I had to look back just to see, you know, and remember everybody in that moment in 1987. But like I said, we appreciate you all coming out. Um, I, I had a good time. Yes. Yeah. Who remembers how many we had in our class? 329. Yeah. But anyway, I say that to say, don't let the ratio to how many graduate with us versus how many are here tonight stop us from doing it again. And we can decide five years, ten years, or whenever, but I say let's keep doing it until we can't do it anymore. We are warriors for life. I want to go back to 1987 so I can run without pissing my pants. Who was our class president? Mark. Cammy and Martha. Cammy and Martha. Cammy. Do you want to have words, Mark? No. Yeah. 
Yes, it's so wonderful seeing everybody. And thank you all for coming. I really appreciate it. It's really, it's heartfelt, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Um, to see how everybody is, you know, prospering. It's wonderful I, to reconnect with most of you on Facebook and to see your lives and how your families are growing. So I can't, we're not together in Franklin, you know, township anymore but vicariously or virtually through Facebook, we are still together, we're still a big family. I know I uh, went to, I, w I lived in Franklin and I, 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 no, I'm good, I'm okay. good. Right. From kindergarten, <laughs> <laughs> well, see, from kindergarten to uh, 12th grade. Amen. Yeah. So a lot of you, Debbie, remember her, her, her mom was a nurse. Yes, she Mrs. was. was <laughs> Your parents, some of your parents, you know, what? how involved they were. I think we, we were a special class. We're special people. And so I just want to say thank you for coming. And I, I love you guys. I miss you guys. And, you know, let's try to do this as often as we can. All right? Woo! For those of us like me who are like Facebook voyeurs. <laughs> It is phenomenal. I have not seen you all, a lot of you, in 30 years. I was talking to my seven-year-old this morning, and she was like, well, you know, I'm packing up, where you going? So I walked to my 30th year, and she was like, ooh. <laughs> she was like, I said, sweetie, I'm going to see friends that I have not seen since we walked across that stage in the stadium. Mm -hmm. And um, it's phenomenal. You all look fabulous. And um, much love. Seriously, much love. And I hope everyone has passed around their phones, their contact information, whatever it is, for us to just stay connected. Because when George and I came in, you know, we did the trip down memory lane and drove by Nicola's. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Mimi's pizza. Some of us can eat Mimi's all the time. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's just like, it's so good to see. Us. Right. right. Know. So it's good to see. Right. That's right. It's good to see change, but it was also good to see some things were just like the same. Now, a funny anecdotal stories. So we're driving down Georgia Street. Why did George drive by his house? I said, where are you going? He said, can I pass the house? <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, and I hope for those of us who are coming from out of town, who are still going to be in town, let's get together tomorrow, you know, brunch, lunch, whatever, and just like talk, show pictures. I haven't had a chance to show you all, you know, my three really? beautiful children. I love well, them. So, you know, just just put it out there wherever we're going to be. But, you know, it, it's um, it's very good to see you all. You know, I've been like all over the place, other countries here, other parts of this country, and to come back home and see folks who, like George and I, George pulled out our kindergarten photograph. Oh my God. I was like, Connolly Road. That was back when you went kindergarten half a day. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and so, and of course, George was all She was sitting down. Wait, you're mad. You had your back. We had time. It was, yeah, it was phenomenal. And so, let's just, like Marva said, let's just kind of keep it going. And um, now, I'm not in the grandfather mode yet. You might have to roll me in by the time my kids have children. But um, definitely let's do it again. And um, just keep it up. Just take care of yourselves. Yes. Eat well. Exercise. Live life to the fullest. And <laughs> 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 Can I say something? Of course you can. Give me a
Um, hey, so I just wanted to, since we're talking about like Lisa Franklin, you know, I moved away, but I moved back. My daughter is 22 years old and autistic. But when she was failing and still not talking, when I found out about the dance program at Franklin and how progressive they came, I did everything I can to get my daughter back at Franklin because you guys made me into the person that I am. And if you see me on Facebook, I'm always falling down, but I always get up because all of you people are just so amazing. And my daughter is now talking and she dances. Amen. And an amazing adult with a bright future because she went to Franklin High School. And they hold a spring concert every year for their dance program, and I would like you guys all to come out to see how amazing these kids are. And we need to support our school as well. So, on that note, we ask the DJ to play our song. Somebody tell them we're running on the way out. Don't let it be the last time I class baby seven to get together. You look so beautiful. Set it off, I suggest y'all set it off. 